Hey everyone, um, my name's Julian, as you probably know. Um, right here we have our mechanical engineering team. Um, we just thought we'd just start putting some videos out this year. It's the first month of uh, 2020. And it's a massive year for Tiller Rides, so we're actually going to be rolling these bikes off the production line later this week, uh, later this year. And, um, you know, we thought we'd give you an update every month uh, on how things are going, um, pictures from up in China, all the production line set up. Uh, right now, just a bit of an intro to the team. Um, just in terms of where we're at in the whole production line setup, as you probably know, we raised a whole bunch of money to do this last year. Um, so that sort of happened between then and Christmas. We spent a whole heap of time getting the frame refinements down. So this phase right now is all about how do we get what we've got in terms of design and the prototypes we've built into production tooling so that can be mass produced. So a lot of effort's gone into the frame. In fact, um, Yong Wei, who you meet in a second, has been heavily involved in that. How do we um, do all that? And then the next probably two to three months is still refinement. Then we do the tooling. Then we start getting sort of production samples uh, and then rolling the bikes out off the production line. So that's what you'll see happening over this six month to seven month period. Um, in terms of the team, we have Sam. Sam's been on the team for quite a while now. Um, he's a like, lead industrial designer, mechanical designer, all around good guy. So um, You've definitely met me before, so <laughs> if you haven't, watch some other videos. <laughs> That's right, there's other videos. Rob, head of production, um, also electrical engineer and mechanical, so you'll, you've probably met him before as well, but um, he'll talk in a second. And our newest member of the team is Yong Wee. Hello, Hello. So Yong Wee is uh, originally Singaporean, now lives here. Um, he's been heavily involved in aerospace engineering, amazing mechanical engineer, set up some production lines up there in, in Singapore. Um, and I think what we've really noticed since he's been here is a lot of clarity around what, what are the best ways to actually produce a lot of the parts that we are trying to produce in the next six or eight months. So uh, it's very much a welcome to the team and um, added a lot of value already. Mm. And we, we think it's um, you know adding a lot of value as we go forward. So. It's definitely stepped up the, the level in the office. That's it's, right. It's a whole new tier. And, and Yongwei also speaks fluent Mandarin, so that's going to be a real asset when we go to China and um, see those people. So, so welcome. Yeah, thank you. Welcome. Looking forward to China Tree. Yes. <laughs> so, I guess the, um, just to sort of talk about with the frame, so a lot of work that's gone on with the frame, uh, and I guess the next phase is to actually start turning that, that whole thing into what's that going to look like in terms of tooling to make the frame, because as you know with our bike, the frame is really the core part uh, of the entire bike. So, so that's that, and as we just mentioned, we're going to China soon, so probably just going to talk a bit about that upcoming trip. Yeah, so um, there's a few goals for the for the next Chinese China trip. Um, obviously, it's Chinese New Year at the moment, so we'll just have to wait for them to get back from and then We'll be up um, probably early Feb. Um, we've been talking to the manufacturer for a while now. The main goal of the next trip is to go visit some more of their sub um, suppliers and just uh, get some more clarity on exactly how each of these parts are going to be made, um, particularly. We'll um, talk to in more detail to the frame manufacturer and um, just start discussing the process in a bit more depth. Mm. Um, and probably one of the, the, the large milestones is we're going to place our first purchase order on the um, on our supplier, which is big news. Big and news. Five hundred bikes. Five hundred bikes. Mm. So not small. That will be the first batch of bikes that come off the production line. Um, I mean, tell bikes. Everywhere, coming <laughs> to a corner near you, street street corner. Five hundred corners, yeah, yeah. five hundred. Yeah. Um, yeah, so that's that's happening pretty soon, and yeah, good to get for the next update. Yeah, for the next update. Yeah. So we'll give you a, a summary on how that all went um, when we chat next time. But, um, yeah, that's that. That's about it for that. Very good. Um, as so, as we've probably told most people in Perth here, have ordered bikes. You know, we've done pretty much everything. We haven't fully finalised the carrier design, so Sam's been working away on that. And um, tell us a bit about that, Sam. Uh, yeah, well, I don't want to give away too much, but um, on the next update uh, that we'll give to you, um, I'll be able to show you uh, a first glimpse on what that production carrier is going to be. So we've had heaps of people asking, you know, what's going to look like, how much can it carry? Um, we're pretty excited to actually get something that's custom made for us, looks beautiful and can carry all your stuff. Okay. So I'll be able to show you that next time. So stay tuned for that. 
And uh, yeah, I guess we will be back every month, as we said. And um, I guess another little bit of news I should add in before we go is that we are currently, as you probably have seen, uh, recruiting for a general manager. Uh, we have gone through the process. We found someone we think is absolutely awesome. So we hope to update you in the next month and they'll be probably standing somewhere here for that update. So stay tuned for that. Um, stay tuned for the next update on everything going on on the manufacturing front and um, send us any questions through and we can answer them in these videos too. So thanks team. Bye for now. Bye for now. Thanks. Cheers. Yeah.